hey you guys so in this video i'm going to be showing you how i do a protein treatment on my hair now everyone is different but some things i do want to tell you is that i am low porosity i have 4b a mix of 4b 4c maybe some 4a in there but we ain't gonna discuss her but primarily 4b 4c i've been natural for nine years okay i've been doing protein treatments off and on for the last five years and now i do a protein treatment every two months for me it may you know vary depending on the person. I don't have all the scientific science background to explain to you when you need a protein treatment. So I would be linking in the cards over here somewhere, a link to the Green Beauty channel. She has several different videos um, on protein treatments, okay? So I'm gonna show you what I typically use. Um, and I have a lot of different things in, in front of me, so bear with me. So for this particular video, I will be using Africa's Best Hair Mayonnaise in conjunction with the Green Beauty's channel, Real Protein Treatment. I love this stuff, I've been using it ever since she brought it out, absolutely love it, um, using these together. So with this hair mayonnaise, with this particular um, hair mask, hair treatment, whatever, protein treatment, in conjunction with this, you have to use a moisturizing deep conditioner afterwards. If not, your hair is gonna feel dry. So I have this hair mayonnaise, I also have ORS's hair mayonnaise and be on the lookout because I will be doing a comparison video of these two, okay? I do have different cholesterols here. I have tons of different cholesterols. I have Hollywood Beauty. I have about five different types of this. And then I have Queen Helen. Now this is where it gets a little blurry. There's just a little, this is like a light protein treatment in my, in my opinion with the cholesterol. So sometimes I may do a DIY moisturizing deep conditioner using the cholesterols as the base, sometimes. Um, but again, for this video, I'm gonna be doing Africa's Best with the protein, that's the protein treatment. For my moisturizing deep conditioner, I'm gonna be using Misha's moisturizing deep conditioner as my base. Now, she was okay. I did a formal review of this particular product and it was just okay. But I said, I believe I said in that video, this will make a great base for a DIY and that's what we're gonna do. So again, this is Indulge. And to this, I have added a package of ORS replenishing conditioner. I added two tablespoons of honey um, about one fourth of a cup of this Suave's conditioner and about two tablespoons of oil. Now again, other, <laughs> I've done other DIY moisturizing um, deep conditioners using cholesterol. I mainly use Queen Helen cholesterol, but I also love to use Eden Body Works Jojoba Natural Deep Conditioner. Now I know of several of you have complained that this product has dropped out your hair because I was going back looking at some of the comments because I do have a formal review of this particular product. It dropped out your hair and it just didn't work. So for this one, we wanted to stick with this. All right, you guys. So okay, I'm gonna go ahead and cleanse my scalp and come back on cam with soaking wet hair, okay? All right, y'all, I have stepped out of the shower. I'm gonna go ahead and mix several huge spoonfuls of this African Pride hair mask to the Green Beauty Channel's real, <laughs> real protein treatment. I think I'm gonna do one to one and a half tablespoons of this liquid protein treatment. Now, one thing I do wanna say, you want to ensure that your hair is soaking wet when you apply the hair mask. My hair has started to dry, but that's okay. I'm gonna go ahead and apply it to my hair and allow it to sit on for about 30 minutes. Ryan Little. <laughs> Yoga!
I'm applying this wet and warm cloth to my hair and with my big head it will generate enough heat for the deep conditioner. I'm gonna go ahead and rinse that out and this is what my hair looks like completely soaking wet and it feels like I've done a protein treatment. My hair feels very strong, it feels healthy, but I definitely need to follow up with a moisturizing deep conditioner. Ryan Little. <laughs> So I left this on my hair for about an hour, rinsed it out, and look at my hair. It feels soft. It feels good. Now I can add my leave-in conditioner. And that is it, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye.